It's called avocado hand, and fans of the fruit, both famous and not, are feeling the effects these days when they slice up their hands or fingers while trying to slice up the avocado. Dr. Sanj Kakar, a Mayo Clinic orthopedic hand surgeon, says he's seen an increase in hand injuries requiring surgery as a result of the rise in popularity of avocados. You want to make sure, first of all, your knife is sharp. Jen Welper, an executive chef with the Mayo Clinic Healthy Living Program, says there are four key points to properly cutting an avocado to avoid injury. She says if your knife isn't sharp enough, you'll have to use more force, which increases your chance of something going wrong. Tip number two. We want to make sure that our our avocado is ripe. An unripe avocado will be much harder to cut. Tip number three is about knowing the proper way to cut into the avocado. How to kind of glide into things versus trying to just chop. Taking the pit out can be the last hurdle. Stick into the um, pit there and then just turn. Slow down and take your time. For the Mayo Clinic News Network, I'm Ian Roth.